watchful waiting to differentiate from active surveillance means that we are not going to treat the prostate cancer for several reasons. First, it may be very low risk, meaning a low Gleason score or a low PSA, or the patient may have a less than two year life expectancy due to advanced age or other comorbid diseases such as heart disease or, or several other factors. In any event, watchful waiting implies that the treatment can be worse than the disease and that the patient is more likely to die from their other diseases rather than the prostate cancer and therefore treatment of the prostate cancer is not warranted. Some prostate cancers are high risk, aggressive and more likely to spread. Others are low risk, least likely to have bad outcomes. The biopsy says cancer, but current diagnostic tools provide limited information about how aggressive a man's individual disease is. So most men decide to treat prostate cancer immediately. Once treated, many men experience serious long-term side effects, like incontinence and sexual impotence. Immediate treatment isn't always needed, but right now a man can't be sure if his cancer is the kind that is likely to require treatment or if he's okay to wait for now. What if there was a test that could determine how aggressive prostate cancer is? Genomic Health is developing a new test to do just that. By reviewing the underlying biology of the tumor and using genes from multiple biologic pathways, the test can predict the aggressiveness of prostate cancer when diagnosed, allowing a man to make a more informed treatment decision with confidence taking care of himself with more information and greater peace of mind.